just Counter Strike. We've had the Rebels just the other day in Kato. Yes. We've had, you know, this nine in recent times. Nine. Who are We've now ants, essentially. Snacks is in game leading True. a game of Legion. Shoe yeah. Baller. Yeah. Shoey on Mott Mouse. Yeah. Like, oh, sorry. Shoey, of course. Yeah. Sorry. Uh, Shiny. As, Shiny. As, as our friend as OJ, OJ would like to call it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But, um, you know, like Polish Counter Strike does seem to be having a bit of a resurgence. And uh, we get to see if they can find a little bit of an impact here at the EU RMR. Alex, can I just remind you? Go on. Bet Boom started Katowice against Eternal Fire and Nuke on the CT side and won one round and oh, lost the game 13 yeah. to 1. Yeah, they did. They won the pistol and they lost everything, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, yeah, Nuke's not that. Maybe that's where they. The pick has come from. What was going on outside? What was that? Why was, why was Friends looking? That? He was looking the wrong way. He was. He was looking the complete wrong way. Like that seems. Is he okay? I don't know. I'm <laughs> sure. He was. <laughs> Does he know the map? Does he? Do you think we were not live? I'm not sure. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll look at that later. Yeah, we will. <laughs> <laughs> that was such a weird start. <laughs> what is he looking? I don't know what he's looking at. The anti flash or something. <laughs> <laughs> um, here we are. As it's a quick find from. Demo. Gonna take me a minute to acclimatize to some of these names. Nafani looking to uh, hold on to the CT vent. They've actually managed to claw this back to a competitive round here. And they are making it work. Demo another, only Siren. Siren up the 1v3, and he does it with style. Brings the fight to them. Yeah, let's look at that corpse uh, <laughs> Maybe for a, a second. Is there any chance we can get his, the replay his of his POV? Was his keyboard and mouse Yeah, exactly. In? Was it like a hardware issue? Because I want to know. Isn't it? Because it doesn't. And there's no technical timeout called immediately after. We don't get. We're not going to know, are we? What was he doing? Looking at hell. <laughs> what was he doing? I don't know. Uh, oh well. Oh, maybe we will. No. No, but we we will get the siren clutch. And that was. Uh, and that uh, was good. Yeah, and the fact that Enterprise almost Bang. retook this with that Bang. opening kill towards Yard, which is almost nonsensical. Bang. The siren song sounds. All right, well, that's the start of the bet boom. Let's uh, keep, let's cut, let's find out what friend is up to. <laughs> What's he doing this round? He's moving though, so his, his keyboard's working. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. There yeah. wasn't a, there wasn't a, ooh. oh, 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 wow. That's an oversight on the uh, bet boom side. They can't fumble this one, can they? Are we going to say the one and only every time? Or are we going to go with Toa? Um, I think, I don't like Toa. You don't like Toa? Well, I don't, yeah, I okay, like Toa. Well, we can't call him the one and only. Toao? Or Toao. We could do Toao. Toao. I feel like... It uh, looks like a Portuguese word, doesn't it? Yeah, but it is the one and only. Mm -hmm. So, Toa? Toa. We could do the one and only every time. <laughs> do you want me to try? <laughs> Let's do a half and see how it feels. Okay. Okay. Nate on the noggin. Pajmi goes down. Demo left in a one on four. Spotted out now. The USB signals his position. Zorty. Finish him off, and it's a 2 0 start again. We'll remind everybody we are in the 1 1 column of the Swiss stage of the PGO RMR here in Bucharest, Romania, for the PGO Copenhagen Major for the first CS2 Major. You get all that? Yeah, that's pretty hype actually when you say it uh, like that. The first CS2 Major around the. I'll get you more hype. Here, but you ready to get even more hype? Go this on. will be the last best of one for this group. Oh my. So it's only best of threes from this point forward. And these two teams are the ones with that opportunity to get that two in your column as quickly as possible. One, one right now. Okay. The one and only. Holding over towards Deep Sea Crow. We do see, is that a creep? It is a Craig. Dorty getting naughty. Molly's I'm out quite telling of the position, isn't it? So stalling this secret crawl, a clear on the smoke. They are about to fade. Friends chance. Oh, exist. That was easy. And he gets out of dodge. Now he doesn't exist in round three. Flash towards warehouse. He the bomb here. Yeah, he's still hanging around, the isn't he? One and only. Slipping down the stairs, playing the fade, and Dan is down with the bomb. Bet boom. Seem to be capitulating a little here. 60 seconds, but you've just given over the bomb. Throwing pistols at him. Trying to donate weapons at this point. Chiron. Smoke off, but cut down. Lovely proactive reaction to the throw of the util from Chiron there. So exist. Oh, actually. They he's know, alone now they know the one side. and only is over towards secret. Right, so the one and only towards secret. They but you've exist got is main. Exist main, and that's noted too. So, oh, oh, Zorty just narrowly missed his opportunity there to strike. He's ready for this headshot onto the one and only. 
assist. Ooh, cut down by Siren. Siren is doing fine. everything for this squad right now. A double kill, seven and zero. After a 1v3 in the pistol, Ooh. now he goes down. Zorty still worried about the one and only, but he's long gone. Well, this is the... Oh. oh. Hmm. Well, you got to get the bomb and go. You got to go, Zorty. Fif there's no time. 15, 14, 13, 12. First round for Enterprise on the Starship. Wow. Warp speed achieved. Yeah, and credit where it is due. The one and only with a proactive hold. He was Molotov out of position, and, and Danis probably feeling a little silly there. You kind of had the implication that someone's here. He's extinguished our Molotov, and you you gave yourself a real tough one by gambling as to where you, he may have gotten off Yeah, to. Naphne did the same over towards main, so they were corralled elsewhere. You can see how this round started. Deep smoke, flash as well, the boost over. This was the first fight for Exist. Naphne knowing that Secret was no longer an option, trying to find space elsewhere, but blocked at every turn. Great little round from Exist there, and Demo with the one that matters the most as Bajmi having a bit of a laugh. So, Giggles in the Enterprise camp. They did take a lot of casualties, all things considered. A tactical timeout to discuss their financial options. Who's going to be getting dropped what moving into round number four? I am a uh, siren stan right now. If he's going to be, I think he's going to have to be the shining light for them right now in terms of uh, being capable of posting multi kills and not making too many of those unforced errors, uh, which is required if you want to be taking the W. I today. just want Bet Boom to look put together. Right. I, I don't want them to look disjointed. I want to make sure that everybody's on the same page, that there's some rhyme to the reason. I'm almost positive Demo was on VP for a while. I'm just double checking that now. Oh, yeah. Well, maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was. Uh, no, it was an Anonymo roster, wasn't it? There was just all these mixes of rosters in there for a while. This is a very Illumina, threatening. Anonymo. Uh, oh yeah, Illumina. It was veggie. I was thinking of, of course. Right, well, yard control garnered now. Zorty across. across, and this time not stopped yet. Friend seen enough. Throws out the smoke. No confirmation of molt of numbers. Auto shotgun at the ready towards the door. Maybe ramp pressure as demo. Snap company yet. A very quiet round. 50 seconds remain. Yeah, I mean, this uh, auto shotgun squeak is going to be really difficult to get bypassed without team pressure. They're going to try and go on towards heaven, I think. Nafni's certainly posturing for it. This is where this exist shotgun can catch you off guard. Is Iron ready? And yes, he is. Well handled on the They're entrance. Coming through main smoke. Bajmi got an awful lot of work to do. The whole squad coming his way. The backside anchor one is great. Two un. Available, bomb goes down main side. Demo activates towards the lobby. One and only in heaven. Might be better to call off the save here, gentlemen. Surprised to see them come through that main smoke on the timing. Demo's gonna park himself in the back of squeaky door, see if anybody comes peering his way. Is there a freebie on the docket? Oh, yes, there is. Demo goes Chiron. Is the retake available now? It's only got 12 bullets to work with, but time is on the side of Bad Boom here. Demo makes a move. It's fine from Danis, traded by the one and only. And a second from the one and only. Good but the, damage. the round is lost, but already, you know, they were on a shoestring budget coming into this one. Be happy with the bomb plot. Be happy with the round. Bet Boom 3 on their T side I, already. I like that approach, though, because if uh, Bet Boom there overstepped the mark and give away too many kills, they still could have gone for the retake, right. right? So hanging out in limbo, didn't really lose an awful lot, took a lot down with them. Not the end of the world. A tough round regardless. I I'm glad we didn't just see them run for the hills and go park themselves in CT spawn immediately as soon as they'd lost that site. So staying active, making sure they can stay on the pressure on the economy. Round will still fall to Bet Boom. So knowing there. that they've applied the pressure, they will buy again. And it's threatening. Yes, indeed. Most definitely. Oh, run Ooh. boost. <laughs> oh my god, Nafni's been launched well ahead of the internal timings of the CTs. Demo. Oh, this is a lot of pressure. Yeah, he's feeling the pressure on towards the ramp side. And look at Nafni. This time, wow. best the one and only. Forward, proactive, cut. Ooh, down low. Seven HP. Dodging bullets. Evading. Exist should have him. No, oh my god. smoke. Oh, he's dead, surely. Yeah, it has to be. <gasps> Come on now. Oh no, Nafi's got him. 
friend dead. Someone kill him. He's back in the smoke. He's stuck in the window. Exist can't find him. He's got it. On the fade. On the fade, he's found. Oh, a rifle recovered, but it may be all too little too late here. Nice work from Bajmi. Oh, the smoke gods. Yeah. Stewie 2K blessing Nafani in a round like that. As Dennis will get the final. And three rounds to the good now from Bet Boom. Very fortunate for Nafani, not only dodging bullets, but both smoke timings really paying in his favor. Massive work from the in game leader of Bet Boom. Sure, fortunate, but doesn't matter when you're going to get the round on the board and pump the other team onto an economical. A stream update, no spoilers. But just letting you know that it is Amcal and it on overpass again, interestingly enough. Against Fnatic. Fnatic. Be sure to check that one out if you're interested. That's Fnatic with Afro, Body, Crims, Matty S, and of course, QB. Matty S with a tatty S. Mousepad, mouse yeah. Come on, Khan, get him a new one. Yeah, where's the. Oh, oh, that's the old... Obviously, he's been offered new mouse pads. Yeah, guys, he it's just a doesn't joke. want it. It's, it's a, a gag. Joke. We all know that he's just choosing it's to. It's just use players, that. you know, everyone's got their own kind of, um, what do you call it? Preferences? Yeah. But also, I was going to say something else. You know, superstitions. Some okay. players get funny about that, like, you know, you match day socks or whatever it may be. And Siren on to exit. Yeah, it should be an easy rather. one here, up. Huh? Chiron's already coming in. Late as he all hell, yeah. Demo was not expecting someone to be still there towards the lobby side. And this economical. It's gone the expected direction. Maybe Bajmi's overlooked, but oh my god, yeah. Walking around the corner with an SMG has been punished. Bajmi, good work, and we'll take a Mac 10. Yeah, it's a bit of a miserable weapon to have to wield into the neck, so True. We'll, we'll see if he can find another kill and get a little bit more cash money for it. I'm sure somebody will be more than happy to use it, considering finances slightly strapped. But uh, good for Betboom to finally break their loss streak. They uh, had been stomaching quite a few in recent times. Online qualifiers with losses to Namiga and Fours. They had lost to uh, Fnatic to kick things off here. They had lost to Cloud9 and Eternal Fire over there in Katowice. And uh, eventually a 13 to 1 win over Into the Breach. The embattled Into the Breach at the moment. They'll be playing for their life later today. The final best of three on this secondary stream brought to you by Anders and Henry G. I'll be watching that one. Into the Breach versus 3D Max. And we will be bringing you Saw versus NIP. Yesterday was Valentine's Day, so heartbreak was not allowed. Today, however, we can stomp on any of these teams' hearts, rip them out of the chest, and watch them bleed out. Indiana Jones style. Precisely. <laughs> uh, so there will be elimination today. There will also be sheer enthusiasm as uh, some teams like FaZe versus G2 and VP versus Na'Vi could be locking themselves in for the major as the first teams, Alex. First man first. in. As opposed to last. Out space again. Chiron tasked with taking this space. And Molly to stall the progression. But as we see the X-ray toggle, thank you very much. Oh, that is nice. beautiful work. Team play. Friend nails the orb shot as well on the clear of the smoke. Down goes Chiron. And he's already here. Like, I mean, it's a bit counterintuitive to Molly on the aggress when your AWP is posted, but it doesn't matter when you've got the man advantage. It's just channel bet boom in towards lobby. Nafani towards Cubby outside. Yeah, so Nafani's activation will be key, but because it was an orb to pick up that frag, I guess maybe, just maybe, he's worried about a player in towards main. They're going to set up a smoke wall, and they still have enough time to do so. Is this going to be about forcing a rotation now that they are down a man, or will Nafani actually try and use these smokes? Considering it looks like the old classic, he probably will be using this as a ruse. So top hit likely as ramp aggression should be coming shortly. It's the hot push. Yeah, you're not ready for this though. Yeah, overlooking it, you can see the crosshair placement misaligned. Exist and the one and only here. Oh, nearly gets them lined up towards the Tetris boxes. Danis back. Two versus three, low HP on exist. Still alive though, and down the vents they go. Demo, the still can have Danis. Oh, big headshot to post. Seven bullets. He's, still he's got rotation. another He's got another one. Exist with such low HP. Swap into the M4, can't pull the trigger in time. Puts it all onto Zorty. He's known to clutch, he's known to warp. He's got both of those in front of him here. He knows where both players are. He heard the drop. Barrel bait, swaps over to the Glock. He knows he's got to get a wiggle on. Isolate this, this jewel. This is huge, Alex. Oh, Zorty taking their head with just the Glock in play, and they know he's low. But it's a backside plant. They know he's low! Oh! Zorty, a double on the Glock. Making it look like a pistol round. He's got the biggest gun in the game. 4,750 bucks, and he goes with the starter pistol. Zorty sits him down. 
That brutal. one's nasty. Brutal. And the reaction from Enterprise, it was what you'd expect. Smoke wall comes up. We've lost Space Yard. Let's take some lobby control. They get denied on this top push. Bang, but they trade one back. Danist, he stalls out this rotation. Sure, faffing around with weapons towards the door, but slows the descent. And that is robbery, Enterprise. That one's gonna sting. I mean, you can completely understand it. Like, you can justify it from both means. The fact that you're not actively peeking is because you're waiting for your teammate, but that's the gap Zorty uses. You don't commit to the angle and you get punished for it. Exist, however, has started this round off with a bang. Quite literally, bang, siren out. One not on the dig. And they got the AK back as well. Big. So, armor behind that. Oh, what are you he's up to? He's creeping in, he's creeping in. Making this a play. Is super aggressive, and Chiron will be. Quick to pull it to punish that. Yeah, I think with a lot of these teams, especially the more unknown entities at this level of Counter Strike, expect them to go for out of the box type of maneuvers. Mm. Catch your opponent off guard, cause the chaos, and thrive within it. But now, allow things to go back to a 4v4, all those advantages that Bet Boom started the round with. Return to the status quo. Zordi selling outside. How much does it sell it when you don't throw all three? I guess it supposes it depends Enough on how they're Enough to keep holding. him looking. Right. As they do start to group one out. Oh, no. Find a friend. And there you have the ramp. Defense down. Seven on the T side already, unless the one and only in Bajmi can have a big round ahead of them. Oh, it's good timing. They combine it's forces. Zorty's got the bomb, but he's got his Glock. Watch out. It's the Zorty Glock. No, it's the P250 from the one and only. The one versus two. Danis, Nafani, combine forces for a seventh. And yeah, Enterprise, they consider again that this is CT side nuke. They have to activate now if they want a hope of leaving with the two wins. Yeah, if I'm in a shot, I'd be very happy. Right, the clutch is falling into your favor. You seem like you're sitting pretty at this juncture of the game. This is, again, a match in a 1-1 variety. If you do go up here 2-1 two to one in the Swiss system, you'll have two best of three attempts to qualify for that major. And then we do have the LCQ as well. We'll allow the main portion of the desk to bring you all of that action. That'll be the likes of Parler, alongside of his merry men, Maniac, Pimp, and Blet, throughout the course of the European RMRs. Terrifying prospect now with the orb posted. The one and only committed to main side, he will not have a free route back. I think the smoke ball may have missed. Yes, unless you're deliberately smoking credit card for the main roof play, I yeah, think. Yeah, but it wouldn't connect with the other smoke, no. so I, I do think that it it's has a uh, missed its mark. Well, you've got a lot of uh, presence in this main side. Yeah, Nafani there's a lot of attention, them. isn't there, still? One molly into main, and Daphne could get two. No, may need it. Oh, nearly had them both. Losing that duel exists in trouble. Nice work from Demho. Oh, he racks up a double. And no one more main. Yeah, friend alone. An AWP one versus two. Certainly doable. Is he ahead of this? He is kind of quick to the uh, not running. calculations. They should be not able to running. punch in the digits. Planning safe. Bomb has been planted. Tough round to win now. He's going to have a look. Yeah, sure, but how's he meant to get into this? Chiron has the vents. You would have to be a nice overextension flick out of friend here. Zorty still behind the side. This would be massive. Oh, spots him. Mm, goes for a quick scope. The Doesn't get the first. And yeah, it did dink him. If he hits this no scope, he's got it. Oh, oh friend. Yeah. How has he done that? A sigh of relief. You can see her on the cams, but that is one hell of a clutch to get Enterprise their second. What was Zorty doing? Great question. Not sure. I think what happened is Chiron had the vent. But then he left the vent to go up to window side. So at that point, Zorty is worried about the fact that a player could come down but, the vent. But, but friend fired a shot before Zorty started to cross. Did Didn't he? he? Yeah. Are you sure? Almost certain. Yeah. Let's see if we can catch it. Or did he just miss after Zorty started to move and then Zorty took? Yeah, he he missed uh, the first shot onto Zorty and then Zorty, and Zorty, Zorty was in shot the him open. with a Glock for some. Well, what? that's a gift. That is a gift. These are funky rounds here at the RMRs. Yeah, but it's definitely, this is, it's got a very different um, aura around it. Well, there's the credit card smoke again, so maybe it is intentional coming out of Bet Boom. Also, it doesn't look like the kind of top main 
uh, waterfall smoke kind of do that better, if that is deliberate. Now, I suppose it depends on what you're fighting for, but here we are. Yeah, well, but, uh, hard to question what they're getting up to in some of these rounds. So you've got a lot of forward ramp control here from Demo. It's nice. Well, they have been wanting to biff around main and hut a lot, so understandably so they want to keep up this pressure. Holding the cross is friend, but that smoke will obscure his view. Doesn't have to throw it just yet. It's not smoke now is the time. And Naphany has gotten across unscathed to the credit card position. Oh, beautiful. Friend has been punished. Not expecting Naphany to play in front and ahead of those smokes. And now that was his responsibility shut down. Naphany getting cheeky with it. Lucky they had that forward ramp pressure. Now they have to activate. Demo pushing. Siren should be set to receive. Does do damage. Oh, look at the cover. Chiron. Might go down. It's Bajmi through the hut position, pushing nicely. And here comes Danis. Bomb on his back. Man on a mission. Demo towards the ramp side. That Molly. Oh, it does spread. Puts him into a 1v. Put that one down his throat. <laughs> the one and only. Open wide. Yeah, just as he's poking his head up the vent, Zorty comes flying around the corner, puts the barrel in his mouth. Almost got out of control, didn't it? Yeah. The fact that they're able to push hut and ramp in unison, sure. This is the opener from Naphne towards Yard. Kyron gets the first, but slip from Demo and Bajmi. They find impact back. Dan is from the grave with the molly. Seems important. And the one and only, not going to be happy with that one. I feel like you're not even in a position to contribute in the round. You're sitting on the bloody ladder in the vent. Well, back down to pistols for Enterprise. This half has gotten away from them. Eight to two. Four is the best that they can muster. Ramp pressures drawn Bajmi over. Well, at least he wants to consider it, but if they've already established control, not the best fight for him to take. So he will stay quite passive, you can see, with the X-ray. Zorty using the pistol more than the AWP. Demo coming back up. Wants to investigate. What can you do, Demo? Naphany's not looking. Oh, spots him out. Nice work from Naphany. Doesn't have the bullets. Bajmi will punish. Good trade. Siren on the trade. Wait, now just finish ramp. But you've got a lot of util. You could just head towards ramp right now. Right, smoke off decon. Get the molly in towards the double door side. Clear out. They know that there were pistols towards top because there was a spam battle. So they're still going to test their luck. A squeaky door aim battle walk is always pretty good. Yep, there it is. You see a lot of teams revert to this late within rounds when there's no util. They wait out all those CT smokes in this round. Obviously not as many as Tao will have to fight. He's ahead of it. Will only be good for one. Now it is just exist. Last man standing, out of position. One on three situation. And nine for Bet Boom. Is the game still going between uh, Fnatic and Amcal? I'll update you. On overpass. I believe I have it open. It is still going. Okay. Well, wow. that is telling. They started before us. Yeah. That's already and that's enough info. Yes. That, that could even be constituted as a spoiler. Well, I don't know. No. I'm going to see what the Twitter sphere is saying. Oh, sorry. The X. X, go and give it to you. All right. Well, this is not a competitive affair thus far. Bet Boom showing a little bit of pedigree in those names that we discuss. Much more household now on the side of Enterprise. I think the biggest surprise was their victory against Amcal. So that upset victory seemed like it was setting them on a path to success. But Bet Boom just a handful of rounds away now from putting themselves into that 2 1 bucket. We'll have to wait until the end of the day for the draws of Zorty. No dramas with that one. A hot push from the orb. Has Go the, on, lad. Yeah, they're going to get exchanges on either side of the server. we got to keep on moving. Wow, you don't see this every day. Oh, it's not going to do anything now, is it? Looks cool, though. Dorty's gone across secret with the orb. This is bizarro world right I'm surprised now. they stuck to their guns with the nades after those opening exchanges came in. But regardless, it's all good. That nade tells me that Bajmi doesn't know that Nafani's already in the hut. It does. And it tells Nafani that, too. Oh, very much. If he didn't get that one. <laughs> it wasn't the instant headshot, that's for sure. But they were aggressing lobby again. You can see them activating ramp and hut once more. Nafani will be eventually felled. 3v3. Yeah, here comes Exist. And here comes Danis. Straight up main. You can see there's just a little bit of uncertainty as to where these teams were coming from. No info yard after the early loss of the one and only. Could be double digis. 
Demo Ooh. forced away by the flame. Last round, got to give it a go, friend. As has provided us with a 1v2 already. Has he got a 2v3 in him? Kit present. Could flash for him. His teammate here. Where's friend? Still coming, man. Dead now, of course. 10 for Bepoom on the T half. Yeah, all right. Well, we are seeing quite a clear discrepancy between these names. This is where if you were a team like Enterprise, you would have your best chance against a team like Bat Boom. The best of threes is where uh, more of the households should be able to have deeper runs. But clean and easy so far. Group A of the PGL RMRs. There is uh, that little calculator online. It's like major.im, I think it is, where you can like input all the results that you see happening or the ones that you expect to happen and try and predict what comes next. I never like to count my chickens before they hatch, but I will take a little bit of a look here because obviously you need all of the results to come through before we can uh, correctly predict what's going to happen. So it's quite difficult to get every single one of the matches available. Would you ever be interested in owning chickens? If I had big enough property, yeah, I think yeah. it'd be nice to have some Wouldn't it? Uh, some Imagine your own, own, well, not homemade, but oh. fresh eggs. Yeah. Home brewed. Ramp brush. Ramp brush. And it's down to that. Well, it's just pressure. So they so put a lot in of info. Power position. They just keep faking out all these steps. It's that run towards squeaky, stop, run towards hut, stop. <laughs> now, demo. Does go down, but that seems to actually signify a, a push from Enterprise. They've taken ramp control, and this looks like it's becoming a bit of a Hugo. Wrapping around, going up the heavens. One and only coming in from Main and Chiron. Cut down, back turned on Daphne. Oh dear. Two bullets. Yeah, and not going to connect. Could he be covered? Siren has, however, still positioned nicely. Zorty into cover. Siren's been cut down. Back turned. Zorty's aware of the possibility. He's a sharp shooter is Zorty, especially with Dan's help. Bails him out of trouble. Exist. What can you do? I'd be able to get the plant. Which would be huge, considering. The Galils, of course. So... The bomb, oh, this is going to be a race right now. Slinking down, ready to take the fight. He's faked out the plan. Dennis closes the door. <laughs> and exists. Oh, 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 he could go back up the vent. He could go back up the vent. Imagine. They're actually going to clear Sorty from behind. You're not expecting this one, are you? I'll take the shot. Take the <laughs> shot. <laughs> Exist gets it eventually. <sighs> and now you're going to get shot in the back by Dennis. Yeah, he doesn't know it's Dennis. That's an attempt, but actually no plant. He'd have really probably preferred the plant coming into this oh, one with an eco. Nafani's shaking his head. He's yeah. happy. Two rounds away from being two up, two wins deep at the RMR. That would have been wild, wouldn't it? Because he could have gone back up the yes. van and gone straight up, planted towards that top side and got away with absolute bloody murder. But uh, Enterprise, without the plant, are still going to fall. What? Sorry. It, 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 ex ex excuse me? Sorry? Can we get that one again in slow motion, Excuse DJ? Me? That was uh, that was something, wasn't that it? That was a uh, jumping one-tap headshot from uh, the ramp position. You're well, Napoli letting out the signature roar. I don't think that's how it sounds, but oh. uh, just two rounds away now. Uh, bet boom. Remember the stomp that we've casted, Alex? There is a galil. We've casted a bunch of stomps. We have, and uh, you know, it's uh, it's a change of pace. Well, we don't mind a stomp. No, not at all. It's just you know that there haven't been. When you look at the rounds that Enterprise have won, one of them was a one on two that they should never have won. Mm -hmm. What was the other one? Well, there you go. Exactly. Maybe this is another one. Maybe. Let's see what the call is, Enterprise. Two smokes. That one was slightly off the mark, didn't get the full clear, and this is uh, all a ruse. They're going to use the smoke fade and probably fight towards main and heaven. Interesting. How does this work out for them? Straight into main. Dennis. Got a lot to do. Exist is already just charging, stampeding towards the hell positions. Alti has reacted as well from the ram side. Chiron is going to chill. Chiron is going to chill. Is Alti. Still keeping his head on a swivel. This for the is a potential. hard position to clear for, Ky for on Chiron now. 
Yeah. Because your eyes are towards the CT vent. Oh! Looks away. What's Siren, however, comes into play with a double of his own. And now Dan is double on the MP9 long range, the one and only. In a 1v1, he is the one and only. Remaining for Enterprise to find their third here on the force bike. Has to win this. Compulsory round, and Naphany will just run him down with that MP9. Now then. Just making sure the Galil had a fresh map. Yeah, look, you need to make sure that the guns that you're picking up work properly. Exactly. Because if you pick them up faulty. and you take them the next round, it doesn't work, well, you, you, you're stuck with it. Precisely. So, obviously, just making sure that uh, the trigger works. It's and, functioning yeah, yeah. properly. And that's 12. Lovely jubbly. Bat boom. Just one away from being two to one in the RMR. And they'll have a best of three tomorrow to battle it out. Is it tomorrow? Guaranteed two best of threes that if they do win this, yeah. right? So they'll have two opportunities, two cracks of the whip. And then, of course, we have the last chance qualifier as well. We'll see how that one all filters forward. But yes, tomorrow and uh, then Saturday will be the conclusion. So tomorrow we'll be locking in a bunch more teams. They were locking in two and kicking out two. And then as the event progresses, we uh, will have eight per group. And then one extra team. So there'll be three teams from each RMR EU group, A and B, who will qualify for a last chance qualifier. And the, the tippy top, the king of the hill of that bunch, will find themselves also qualifying for the major. 17 for Europe. That's because it's so dominant in the Counter-Strike sphere. Two for Asia. And uh, five for the Americas. That'll be going on in uh, Shanghai for Asia and uh, in Monterey, Mexico. Monterey? Is mm -hmm. that where the, the cheese comes from? Monterey Jack? I'm not sure. You've asked the wrong question. I was talking about Counter-Strike. Oh, no, yeah, same. But I could... You know, we've had some cheesy Counter-Strike. I figured I'd go full circle. Well, 3D Max is coming up later. Monterey Jack. It is. Yep. Setting their sights on A. The one and only. It's up the squeaky door. Okay. Up on the rafters is Siren. Dennis back on the side. Unloads the mag. And friend finding another one back. Still, Siren doesn't have the chance to get the gun out. Good work on the Tech 9 from Demho. Needs to reload. Two Kyron and Naphne. Oh, well, Kyron's actually found Exist. Needs the main smoke to get them nervous. Bomb still goes down. They're still so focused. Both focused on the main position. Not considering hut right now. Naphne, he's crawling through. Kyron repositioning towards the heavens. This is an uncomfortable one to hold in the post plan. Enterprise. It all to do to start what would be one hell of a comeback. Clearing through, CT Vent's going to be a hard clear here. Chiron's going to surely have him. And now it falls down to none other than Bajmi. And Chiron just stampeding down. Well too easy for Enterprise's third. A beautiful play from Bajmi. Call that a 1v2. Yeah, just walked into towards top side, got a couple of kills, and gave themselves that number advantage. But not out of hot water just yet, are they? It is going to be quite the climb to make this a competitive matchup. It has been a one-way street. You'll be happy with that, but hold up. You've got to tussle with this. Zorty mm. onto the shotgun, a Famous for Chiron, a Deagle for Naphne. And so five sevens to boot. This would be a bit of a sour patch. For these kids. making no secret of his purchase. Yeah, and the one and only is just running straight into him. It could have been another, you know, that's a lot of damage. Zorty didn't finish his meal. Friend yeah, has got three HP. I see what he was trying to do, but couldn't let the fight come to him, couldn't he? Certainly. Oh, Ooh, Chiron robbed there. Didn't get the bullets in the right direction, and he's gone down as well. Well, we do have a few more rounds of this one then, don't we? All right, let me get comfortable. Just settle in, everybody. It's just going to be the five sevens remaining. Maybe Siren and Danis. They are pretty, pretty on these pocket rockets. Friend has the bomb. Announces his presence with a smoke. Exist, clearing out A. So will this be enough to get the rotation back around the world? They don't need to commit towards the B bomb site. There's still so much time on the clock. Enterprise will be ill-informed to play their hand early. So by taking their time, by exploring their options, they haven't committed to anything too silly like marriage. So... They're on A, and that's likely where this round will stay. It should be 12 to 4. Yeah, Siren and Dennis divorced from the site. I'm just going to accept that this one is the fourth. And probably the fifth. Most likely. Yeah, with that force buy from Bet Boom. Yeah. Have you ever integrated the Nova into your gameplay? Can't say I have. No. Plenty of other weapons I'd prefer to use than that one. Mm-hmm. Like the Mac 7. I don't, yeah, 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 yeah. Obviously, price playing a factor as everything in life. 
Not an auto shot to use a use around. No, I think the auto shot is actually the best out of the bunch. It is. It's one hundred percent, but also a hefty price. Yeah. Two grand. But I think if I was gonna go for the Nova or a five seven, I'd take the five seven. The five seven does seem like the, there are rounds uh where you'll find yourself, if I had a 5.7 instead of a ball, that, yeah. I would have. 20 bullets. 20 right? and one bullet headshot close. Like, it's pretty scary. Very. Well, they're going to hold on to the shotgun, because why the hell not? It's better than nothing. Full focus. No margin for error for these boys. Wow, that's a funky looking mouse and mouse pad. There's the mouse forest uses. Is it? Yeah. It's got a, an, it's it's an extra fire. shape, is it? Okay, yeah. interesting. It's got holes in it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's like the M1 or something like that. J-Raz would know. But uh, J-Raz on the A-Stream right now, doing all those context cams. Oh, um, Chad, is the UI bugged or have they bought the same thing again? The UI is bugged. It's bugged. Well, Zordi could have been dropped the shotgun. I don't think they have. Bugged. Because Nafni had a deagle in the last round. It's just Seuss's and USPs, I think. Okay. All right, can we just look at Danis? Chef, can we take a look at what Danis has got? It is a FAMAS. Oh, no, it's, it's, oh, it's happening. Okay, interesting. Did they save the FAMAS at the end and we didn't see it? Oh, maybe that's it. Yeah, he's got Kev That could well. be the he's case because in the Kev. replays. Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah, it's all good. Okay. Yeah, 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 see? I got a see, little confused. Good. I got a little good. worried there. Thanks, Chef. Thank you, bro. Let's see what uh, these two are working on. Lockers. So again, trying to constrict around towards this heaven space. Waterfall smoke. Ooh. I think they missed the locker smoke. Hmm. Yeah, funny, it's already calling lobby relatively quiet. Imagine me just tasked with a passive hold towards the lobby. Zorty holding Shotgun down. on the ladder, however. Yeah. Could be valid. Could be valid, but the lobby crunch has been... Stopped, and that's the shotgun on the oh. ladder. Double pump to Demho, puts a rifle into their hands, but not expecting another nice patron salad, the one and only. We've got another from Enterprise. That's the fifth. Yeah, as expected. Yeah. Right. Uh, so sure, there was a couple of weapons that we didn't expect to see, but Bet Boom making sure that they've got their scavenging down point. Down point? On point. On point? Down, down pat. pat. Mode the two. But they will get the guns back out now, so their chance to finish before it starts getting a little bit too hot under the collar. Still so much breathing room. There is a massive void that Enterprise will have to fill if they even want to make this comeback a possibility. This isn't the type of event where you're going to be given up at any moment. Squeaky smoke deployed, lurk smoke out from the T's as well. Stalled towards Yard from now. They are a little bit worried about an aggressive maneuver from the CTs, but we can see Duron Ron hanging out here behind the unbreakable box. Surely they don't go dry. They have smokes that they could limp out from behind red. I think we're seeing them line those up now. Kyron has a HE, so keep your eyes on that. Yeah, should the smokes land, he can even clear for himself. There they are. And here he goes. Safe. Um, Bothered. And, ooh, ooh, friend, a narrow miss there. Zorty, however, has been brought down by Bajmi. Demo activating forward position. Ammo. Onto Nafni here towards the hell position. Good find from Nafni, so the three on three. It does hang in the balance with Exist already down towards Secret side. If the bomb can join him, they've got a real portal into another round here. He went quite quickly, but Nafni's ahead of this rotation. 15 bullets in the mag. The rotation point for him likely down the vent, but that should be covered off. They can do so with a molly if they so desire. Do they go single or double? That's the next big question. Nafni on the rafter will be able to mantle up and look on down as well, they're coming in. 25, Nafni in a power position here as they're clearing dark. They sweep through. Good work. One and only finding Nafni. Should be theirs now. It's a hard angle to clear that. So, yeah, the parthing impressing Chad. And we are looking to be getting that bomb down. Do they give this a look in? Probably not. Without a kid, how are you meant to get back into a round like this? That's the question I'd be asking myself if I was Bet Boom. Can you go back and uh, scavenge some AKs? Maybe grab yourself some utility off of the ground? That would probably be one of the more advised decisions for Bet Boom right now. But Enterprise, they keep the game going. 
been able to break back into this. It was very, very tough in that first half of play. Siren, we find him roosting all the way back in towards T-Spawn. You see that simple approach. Get out towards red, apply the standard old school wall, have one player dart across for the space, the others look for a fight on those rotating players. Come out on top of the brawl. Follow through with that lower play, and it really comes down to getting that clean frag onto Nafany on the B bomb site. That is the difference maker right there. If Nafany goes one for one, it's a 2v2 situation. Maybe, just maybe, Betboom would have considered the retake, but the lost bonus building now for Betboom. Do we see them go for another partial investment, or will guns be dropped across? Well, as we can see here, they have been able to get an AK for Danists. It's just going to be a light investment, so it will be a full gun round into the next, but Enterprise, you're playing the remainder of this half with your backs against the wall. Straight in the heart is Chiron. Orb towards outside on friend again, as the support of Exist. Barge, we can farm here. May not be expecting so many players leaving. Well, this is peculiar. They just kind of faked it out. Now spots it out. Uh-oh. It's the, the rifle immediately. I don't know why they're not clearing lobby properly. Right, they've done that twice now. They've taken space and then they've gone, oh, well, I guess it's clear. And then they've just completely darted it out of here. Bajmi will be dealt with, but Zordi, you can't go any further. How good are your hands? Pretty damn long fingers and nades down the back pocket. That one's going to sting. He's running the hell out of dodge here. Demo's going to be holding for him. Beautiful work. Managing his angles well for a two versus four. One hell of a T campaign being built here from Enterprise with their backs against the wall. See how they immediately left lobby. They went to boost hut to get heaven space back because they're worried about the way that Enterprise are playing so much of this play yard, getting and constricting right. heaven and hell. So they don't want to keep giving that up, but still could have dealt with lobby in a much more timely manner. I'm not sure if everybody needed to evacuate in such fashion. Now, Exist is low, but uh, one of the keys is Bogdan's Law. They have been able to keep all four members together. Watching the tail of this will be Demo. This can still go wrong, Alex. Look at the time. 25 up against two of them. And they're both on A. Yeah, Siron. Siron? Siron and Chiron. You're going to clear this. Oh, Jumping? What? what? <laughs> the one and only. Nailing a ridiculous 12. shot. Hold on. It could have gone wrong, friend. Saves the day with a necessary frag. Exist he had was one HP, air, right? But yeah, it looked like it. Yeah, it looked like he jumped around the corner. And shot him in the head. And shot him in the head at the same time. Well, they've drawn this back to a five-round game. Enterprise working hard at this one. Tactical timeout to be called. Is Demo reading the water bottle? Yeah. Making sure it's got the right vitamins and minerals. And yeah, do Enterprise have the minerals to take this to overtime? Bebe into H2, go one more round. And Inner Shine, 30 seconds for him to chip in. What do we need to do on the CT side, boss, to finish off the game? Well, now that you've seen their approach on Yard, the way that they are really trying to constrict heaven and hell, I feel like getting a player red pole right back a warehouse would be strong to deal with this. Right, having somebody start secret could also be a good idea. And then your AWPA can play from heaven. Is he crossing? Yeah, he, he is. He's gone red pole side, Zorty. So, will he stay committed? That's the question. Actually wants to fight. So, active. We've seen this boost a few times. Wow, impressive reaction speed. Pin yeah. now, though, isn't he? Yeah, he's, to, he's forced to smoke himself out. This At least he thought he did. Oh, spots him. Doesn't pull the trigger. All five towards Yard. One silo, four on the lower side. So he's got a lot of opportunities available to him. Recovery from Enterprises. Try and get across secret for their eight. Again, they only send Exist running. The rest are going to do the same play. It's the same maneuver. Get one down for space. Fight towards main. No one's Again, actually right? Heaven yet. and Hell, no, name same. of the game. If they had a rifler, back a warehouse right now. Kyron would have been a dead man. And they've just gone for lobby space. It's such a standard response. 45. Demo's coming. He actually got the bomb here. Oh, so yeah. This frags truly. Oh, dear. It hinges on Chiron. The round 
is up to Chiron. And Dem Hope is the one to take him down. Looking good. And the opposite for Bet Boom. Siren stubborn for one, but there you go. Safe. It's another round for Enterprise. Are they really doing this? I can't believe it. What a massive hole that they found themselves in. And the fact that they're getting away with the same approach round after round, just rinse and repeat. They've brought themselves back into a four round game, and it was a bleak half. That first time. Oh no, it's just dawned on me. CT side Bet Boom. Eternal Fire. Yeah. Katowice. Yeah. One round. Seems their CT side is very exploitable. What's going on? It shouldn't be this easy. What well, seems to be the problem, Doctor? Can you diagnose well, that, what, it? What I said, just send a rifler outside. You don't have to fight for the space, And he just right? sits there holding main Yeah, side. because if they want to keep going around, they're gonna. that's a very difficult place to clear. And oh, then yeah. if you have your AWPA over towards Heaven and Hell, think about the crossfire that that establishes. Yeah, no, for sure that makes sense. Oh, no, they might even chase Sorty down the nade. Oof. Do him a whole lot of damage, didn't no, it? No, I think if he if the lead had landed square on his jaw, that might have been a problem. But yeah, all right. Well, Zorty, quite fortunate, raised the eyebrows, and yeah, this one's getting sweaty. Enterprise. I mean, you know. Come on, let's go. I know if they can do this every round at a time. This just one next round. Don't try and think about the bigger picture. Don't think about what's at stake. This would be one hell of a comeback, and this would actually be like the the bet boom tilt factor starting to come into play as well. You start thinking of yourself, you know? You start thinking, do, do, do we suck at the CT side? It's not the first time they've had troubles closing out or even having a strong CT side here on Nuke. A little bit of a smile, belief on their face. As that's the second tactical pause, and it's common to, it feels like an achievement for Enterprise. You've forced another one out of them as they're trying to find the solution. But this has been a great tea half. How, how are you going to mess with it? You have another one of these rounds where they save a couple of guns and they upgrade in lightly around them. There's always moments before disaster where things could go wrong. You aptly pointing out that bomb going around the heaven side. But if you're at that first shot and there's not that multi-kill from Chiron, you're in the clear. So 50-50, coin toss in that moment. Mm, so timeouts elapsed. It's bet, boom. Kind of counting on the save day WP with a smattering of half investment. You could've, you could've run a... Come on, man. You're gonna try and get in his ear, man. Because it's okay that th that one player goes down secret. Oh, what the hell? Well, taking a risk, I, I, I understand. I get it, right? They're, they're scratching their heads a little bit. It was a desperate maneuver. And outside, traditionally, they've had some forces, but now it's a fake, it's a ruse. They won't know that. It's gonna force the rotation. Nafani's had to drop down with the M4. It's just gonna be Danis and Siren with MP9s. Zordi's a ramp. This is another Enterprise round, looking good. Need the smoke, pushing, turns the flash. Oh, Danis nearly doubles up. And Demho still clean. Nice He's really clean with it. Takes down Siren. The one and only clears up the problem out the yard. And yeah, this is another converted round for Enterprise. Zordi, what you got for us, mate? A knife out as he tries to save his AWP for the next. It is surprising that Bet Boom look the way they do with the names they have. I think that's one of the most astonishing things with this team. Obviously, in Sydney, we were like, oh, yeah, they, they look all right. But that's when Counter-Strike or CS2 was just being played very raw, in your face, quite aggressive, which I think goes well with the way Nafani likes to play the game. But we've quickly become tactical again, and the nuances there, and they just look mid, to use the youngster vernacular. Yeah. And Zorty as well, you know, he's actually probably the only player that seems to be... Um consistently uh, present for Bet Boom. Yeah, and remember we saw them have the meltdown in Katowice where like Danis and Nafani were like, oh, come on Zordi, you need to hold on to this, mate. Oh, oh, well, he can still buy one. He's I got 6.7, but, but yeah, it felt like it should have been his, didn't he? What are you he? doing there? He threw the wickets. Or beside the wickets. Either way, this is getting very close. This is getting scary. Chiron really just trying to finish the game now. He's like, oh, one round, if I just... If they're just not looking at me. Yeah, they, well, I think they probably thought, hey, look, they've been using outside light. If I can just be disruptive so right. they can't do the later smoke wall after we've had that pause. But he just went and was like, no one here, boss. I'm going to keep going. They wound him up. They let him go. Surely not letting this one go. Bet boom. There it is. The position has finally been taken by Chiron. Will this be the recipe for success? Well, Enterprise no longer doing the same play through Yard. Different looking smoke wall. Waterfall Twist plus two. And the Vitality Diag. 
And they're coming into Siren's domain. Has he got it in him? Perfect flashes. Team play there. It's a double into the top side from Exist. And because they've adjusted, as I said, they should a couple of rounds ago, they're now out of position. The top side under fortified. Only two bodies can't get anything done. It has to be another save, and that's if they can. Yeah, they're just like two steps behind right now. The thing is, they should return to this same setup again in the next gun round. But whether or not they will, because right. like you said, they're behind the way that they're playing. Oh, they're just going to get hunted. Why not? Chase them down, boys. Let the dogs off the leash. They've got extra cash to splash. Why not? Try and uh, soften the blow into your next one. Reduce what your opponent can work this with. This would be a huge choke from Bat Boom, wouldn't it? Oh, it would be colossal. This would be some liquid level stuff. <laughs> yeah, maybe we, it's, the bet, it's the new Bat Boom. Let's see what we can find here. I'm trying to remember what the... Uh... It's 10 to 2, huh? Yeah. But when did they get 12? How long have they been on the ropes? Oh dear, Zorty goes down again, this time to the bomb. So seven rounds consecutive. Make it eight. I think it's going to have to be... 12 to 2. It's going to have to be another partial investment around these two saved at guns again, with the max loss bonus giving them a buy for the final round. So likely to see, that, and look, obviously anything can go wrong. All it's going to take is one round where one of these players on Betboom manages to get a multi, but they've just burnt their third and final time, uh, tactical timeout of regulation. So if I'm in a shine now, I'm discussing the finances of this round. Here it is, round timeline on your screen. This highlights it perfectly for everybody at home. So in the first half, there's only two rounds that fell in favor of Enterprise. One was a clutch that they never should have won. It was friend down towards the lower side, picking up two kills, one onto Zordi back side, and then onto Chiron window side, combat all ping. Then you move into the second, they get the pistol, the conversion, and this is with four spies in back to back rounds from Enterprise. And now this is just a two round game. Yeah, you're probably also regretting that kind of like semi quasi four spy with Famas and Nova which didn't go your way, slowed you Well, down. that's another good point because you had such a commanding lead in the game that you could have just taken like some safer rounds and, and, and really just allowed your economy to build before going in for those type of buys. But regardless, can't take it away from Enterprise. They have been looking hot to drop. Yeah, and here we go towards the yard position. Chiron has not opted to go towards Red Pole. You know, just notice though how they've opted for different smoke walls now. So you can see that they're going for this diagonal play, whereas before it was get red control, do the two smokes for the shortest distance across. They would send exist across for the space, and then they would pressure towards heaven, right? With three bodies going main and on top of the red box. Now this is a different look. This can still go wrong. Uh, Danis, oh no, Kyron's already found one. Siren has as well. The one and only has gone. Pushing through the smoke was Demho. And all of that hard work seems to have slipped away. In the blink of an eye, Bajmi and Friend, what have you got for us? 2v5. A 2v5 for all of the marbles to survive. It was quite the hell of a comeback. Friend working on ramp. Naphne's here. Tucked in. I'm sure he'll give it a good clear if he goes, but not partnered up with anyone here. <laughs> And not ready for Nafani. Down he goes. Oh, you would think with all the opportunities Bet Boom had, it had to happen eventually, and now it has 38 seconds left on the clock. This would be a one on five for the history books. Paul Bajmi up against it right now. But Bet Boom, this one will just be a sigh of relief as you find yourself in the 2 1 bucket in the Swiss stage. It's all good, says Nafani. It's not a problem. A win's a win around here. Still smiles on the faces. It was commanding 10 to 2 at one point. Not even worried. What? 12 to 2 after the pistol and the conversion. And they're brought all the way back. So a tough one. A tough one.